Right, folks, back. Um, I am at the moment doing the uh, McCoys, so if you've not seen that video, go and watch that one as well. Um, I went to Iceland, and I love chili dogs, right? I love a hot dog, I love a chili dog. I think they're absolutely fabulous. Um, we have made our own chili dogs in the past, but they get very messy, and I love them. Anyway, I went to Iceland to get these McCoy things and the other, the uh, loaded chicken wings that uh, we have plans for. And um, as I was walking around, they've got this new fridge bit that's for Ed's Easy Diners. So I picked up the chili dog. Uh, the chili dog was three pound, which is rather expensive. Uh, rather expensive for, um, that's what it is. Uh, expensive for Iceland, I think, but we will see if it's worth the three pound. Now, so what we get is this. For the visually impaired, I'm holding it up. There's a dog, uh, there's a hot, there's a sausage, there's a bun, um, there's some other stuff underneath. Um, let's have a look what we have to do. Uh, remove, remove the sachets. Right, remove the sachets and put them in a bowl. Remove all the packaging, get down Twoodle. Uh, remove all the packaging and paste the sachets into a hot bowl of water. No water in the kettle. And while I'm over here, I'll get a bowl. So put them in there. Now this, Morphe Richards, is the loudest kettle in the world. We hate it. We hate this Morphe Richards kettle. Um, we had it, um, I think we got it from a, Trudel's up, oh he's had me doing that. We got it, and um, from a vouchers that I had when I used to work for Mexichem in Mexico, uh, Mexico in Melton. Fucking Mexico, commute to there every day. And uh, anyway, bought it through that. We had it about a fortnight. It was fine, there's no wrong with it. After that, it just got so loud and it's got all, it's just shit. So, should have reviewed it. So, uh, right, place hot dog bun onto a microwavable plate for one minute. So, the bun is on there. Put it in there. One minute. Alright, let's put the hot water over here. The hot water has gone onto the chilli and the cheese. Oh yeah, it got steamed up there. Steamy windows! Right, so, that goes in there for a minute. And then it is, place hot dog onto a microwave, uh, the bun onto a plate. Cook for one minute. Place sausage into a microwave plate. Uh, place the sausage onto a microwavable plate and cook for one minute thirty seconds. Turn halfway through uh, cooking time. Place the chili beef sachet into a microwavable plate. Pierce the bag and heat for one minute. Assemble the dog. Garnish. Right. So. That's been put on there. So, uh, place a sausage onto a microwavable plate and cook for one minute. So we'll take that off there, we'll put that on there. Oh, 
What's that? Place sausage onto microwave plate and cook for 1 minute 30, turning so. Right, so what I'll do is. No, that's. Uh, Right, so I'll put that in for 45 seconds and that'll be it. Right, I've just got to change the battery because it's flashing. Uh, right folks, so I have cooked the, uh, the, the, the dog and I picked it up and it didn't feel very hot. There is nothing wrong with our microwave. Um, perhaps I just didn't have it set for long enough. So, uh, what I've done is I've put it in for another 30 seconds. I have now got to... Place the sausage onto a microwave plate, done that. Turn off in three, done that. Place the, the chili beef sachet onto a microwaveable plate, pierce the bag and heat for one minute. Assemble the dog with the garnish and the mustard. Right, so. So that goes onto a. I'll tell you what I want to do. Bear with, folks. <coughs> so, put that on there for a second. Let's get another plate. Right folks, so it's six at the moment. Um, I've got the dog there. Can open that up. Put the dog in there. Let the twirl back in. Wait for this chilli to be done. And then it says, assemble. Now, I personally do chilli dogs like this. I get the chilli. I open the bun and I squeeze the bun inside, right? So it makes it more of a submarine kind of thing. Ow, and that's fucking hot. I think I need to cut that a bit bigger. I wanted to... Try and control the flow. So, you put the chilli in there like that, you see. Right? You put the dog on top of the chilli. And then you put this on there. Now, I know it doesn't look like the picture but it's i'm sure it's easier to eat like that what do you think that is just how i do it there is no rules there is no regulations on anything like that it's just so well, Let's tuck in. Right, I'm just going to bite the sausage end off first. Mm. 
Mmm. That is surprisingly nice. Mmm. Pork, water, I dose, I dose salt, potassium, chlor. Get down you. There's loads of stuff in this. Red pepper powder, glucose syrup, stabilizers, dips, sulfates, antioxidant, absorbic acid, parsnip powder. Dried onion. There's fucking loads of shit in here. Probably not safe to eat. Well, it probably is safe. It's just that you have to eat it in moderation. Right, now let's tuck in to the actual donkey's knob. The cob is a little bit, but the actual sausage and stuff itself is really nice. Let me just um, try a bit of the cheese on its own. Oh, that's nice. The bottom of the bun's soggy. I suggest next time if you microwave one, turn it upside down so the bottom of the bun doesn't go soggy, so that it doesn't actually fall out. That chilli is really nice. McCoy's just done. Mm. For three quid, you can't fault that. I think that's really good. It's fucking hot. Mmm. Well done, Eds. Well done, Iceland. It says it's all cooked in 3 minutes 30 seconds. You don't cook things in 3 minutes 30 seconds. But, that is really good. I'm impressed. Let me know your thoughts, folks. Mmm. That is really good. Iceland do do some good stuff. Get yourself down to Iceland and try that folks. If you like hot dogs and you like chilli dogs that's a winner winner hot dog dinner. Laters.